Well, this is a job that uh, is pretty easy and straightforward, uh, but definitely is one that needs to be done more often than it really does, uh, honestly. Um, so it's probably a couple of years overdue since I've done this. Uh, so finally have a uh, new dishwasher, uh, unrelated. Uh, finally have a new set of, yeah, you guessed it. <laughs> you guessed it. Headlights uh, and quarter markers. So <clears throat> I usually get about a year and a half or two years out of these headlights um, and quarter markers before the little tabs break on the headlights and they point downward um, and you pretty much can't see. Uh, not to mention they become really opaque, uh, you know, from the sun and everything. And I've tried before to um, restore these things and use their, their yeah, there's the broken mount right there. So it's sitting in that position as opposed to this position to that position makes a pretty big difference. So um, I've tried to repair these things before and, you know, do the, uh, that one's broken too, and uh, do the, um, you know, the little restoration kit that you can get. And uh, I don't think they work all that great. I mean, for 65 or 70 bucks, you know, just to replace them, the new ones look uh, way better. Um, you know, so this is a pretty easy job. It's already got LED headlights and everything in it. So we just need to replace these. As you can see, the old grill uh, is on currently. The other grill, the updated one, uh, where we're just waiting on the, I need to get some clear coat and I touched up a few spots. Um, need to re-clear it and then also um, waiting on the uh, insert to get here. So we're gonna unbox these. Uh, that's coming up since we're unboxing these headlights and we're gonna start getting these things disassembled. You can see going with these, um, I like the orange uh, side markers. Um, it's just, even though it's an OEM replacement, uh, this definitely makes a huge difference um, from the way that the truck looks now um, with kind of the, and I even I even think, thought about going to uh, like the, um, the tinted ones, but these are being sun damaged. We'll do, this is the before picture, we'll do the after picture here in a little bit. So I was kind of waiting for the, uh, Kind of waiting for the new grill uh, to get in so I can do it all together, but I was driving last night and it's just totally, it's just junk. So trying to drive this thing, um, you know, so we're gonna go and get this thing busted apart and uh, yeah, there it is. I will say that the nice thing about these uh, LED bulbs that I purchased probably five, six years ago, I've had LED lights in this truck for 
I will say the nice thing about these LED bulbs is that they've lasted for a long time. I've had these LED bulbs in the truck for quite a while. And uh, I've done, I think this is my third pair maybe of headlights. And uh, yeah, these LED bulbs off Amazon. I think I got them uh, like at Amazon and maybe uh, Advanced Auto Parts. They seem to work pretty good. question with this stuff is always is it worth it um, to do these cheap Amazon headlight assemblies and my answer is always going to be yes just because uh, I've tried to use the um, repair kits you know to buff and polish them um, and those work uh, pretty well but when they break the tabs here on the back side um, you know, behind the uh, behind the low beam is where I just think they're kind of a loss. So, you know, if uh, if every two years, you know, two and a half years, this is what you got to do. I would say that it's a uh, a worthwhile investment. They're easy to install, and they look way better. Um, and if they're not leaning down, I think that's the goal. So, hopefully, in the next video, we'll be uh, getting the this old grill off and getting the new painted one with the billet insert on. Peace. Well, see you later.